good evening and welcome. There's so much to be enthused about going into tonight's contest here at the home of Manchester City. I'm Derek Ray and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And what we have for you tonight is live Champions League group stage match day one action. It is Manchester City against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. Starting players for Manchester City. Ederson between the posts. Paul Walker plays with Joao Cancelo in the fullback positions. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. the Paris Saint-Germain starters. Gianluigi Donnarumma is the keeper. Sergio Ramos plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Lionel Messi starts with Neymar in the wide positions. And the main striker today is Kylian Mbappe. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway. Chance to cross. Rodri. Holland. Foden. Is this the moment? And now he must score. There it is. And he could scarcely have had an easier finish. Well, just look at the defending here. They've made it so easy for him in the end. That's just not good enough. more and it's going to be interesting to see whether or not PSG can articulate an appropriate reply Verratti now with Messi well read to win possession back Joao Cancelo he just needs to remain icy cool. And Bernardo Silva has it. And players waiting in the centre. Pulls it back. And delivered by Bernardo Silva here. A deft clearance. Grealish. And intercepted it. Well, slightly off target, and that'll be a throw in. Renato Sanchez. Oh, a nice looking pass. 
And the penalty has been given here. Well, he's avoided a booking, but the complaints continue. And I can understand why. I think it's a poor foul. It should be a yellow card for me. An opportunity to level matters. And the spot kick is converted as coolly as you like. Well, as you can see, the keeper makes no effort in the end. He was hoping it would be struck down the middle, but it's an easy finish, really. So back underway, one goal apiece here. Silva. Holland. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Another look then at the penalty goal. Hakimi. Messi. Mali prevented it from going over the line. Mbappe. And no way through. Sanchez. Hakimi. And the ball back with City now. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. And the flag raised. Offside it is. Ramos. The referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City. Rodri. Now Holland. Lovely ball over the top. Walker. The Bayer. The keeper diving magnificently to make sure he got there. And played short. Joao Cancelo. Manuel Akanji. Possession one. Behind for him to chase. Foden. Bernardo Silva. And now Rodri. Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. Foden. 
keeping possession of the ball with authority. And the advantage is with PSG. Neymar. Not showing good patience. Couldn't find a teammate. Throw in here. Joao Cancelo. Holland. Foden. Beautifully disguised ball. And a wonderful diving save to deny the opportunity. Well, opting for the short corner. Pulls it back. Oh, incredible save. And he snuffed out any sign of danger. favoured a short one here cuts it back brilliantly blocked Well, it's been all City in the last 15 minutes or so. They're creating plenty of chances and looking a constant threat. You feel they have to take the lead at some point with this sort of domination. Now PSG moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Mbappe. Not really the ideal clearance. Messi. And blocked for now. Real chance. And the keeper showing tremendous command. Over it comes. The high press was on, and the chance is on. Oh, marvellous save. Great goalkeeping. Rodri, Akanji has it. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, three minutes to be added on. Messi. Oh, just wide of the mark. Goal kick. Well, that never looked like troubling the keeper, did it? But it was worth an effort, a good strike from him. Ruben Diaz and the keeper with the ball Walker Rodri and so the half-time whistle is sounded here in Manchester excellent first half showing from Neymar in this game Stuart well he stepped forward for his team with the equaliser it could prove to be the key turning point in this contest as they haven't been at their best today you do feel they need to find another gear in the second half, though. If they... And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Well, that's how to beat your opponent. And well, his teammate got him out of trouble. Jack Grealish. Foden. Oh, he's gone for goal. And still danger here. 
Walker. And making sure nothing untoward happened following the cross. Now can they counter clinically? Possession lost. Good pressure. Can they make something of this? And using his body to good effect. Kevin De Bruyne. There's a slide rule pass. And a really good diving stop. Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? play here and I must say that was a very promising attack the alarm bells were sounding and breaking at pace with menace and threading it forward well that has been deemed offside Stuart well he took too long to get the pass away it's as simple as that PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. Bernardo Silva. And out of play, the pass nearly worked out, but not quite. Paredes. And Messi carries it forward. What's he going to do from this position? Oh, that goes down as a wonderful save. But hang on, offside is the decision here. Holland. Take it away. Messi wonderfully weighted pass so half an hour remaining and the flag was up in good time it's offside well he should have realized that was going to be offside that's a poor decision to play that pass substitution it is for PSG Number 20, Victor Ferreira, coming onto the pitch. Number 27, Idrissa Diorre. Walker. Now with Silva. Holland. Rodri. Phil Foden now passing it around looking for the goal that would put them ahead giving the ball away Grealish can they forge ahead they do and you've got to say they're good value for the lead Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. ball is moving again anyone's guess how this is going to finish 2-1 currently
the tackle completely mistimed and you would expect a booking under the circumstances and a yellow card it's going to be Stewart yeah the ref's got that right it's a yellow card all day long and Manchester City will go to their bench he's played it short here Oh, a lovely ball, and a goal! An end-to-end -end game, and they weren't behind for long. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb, and then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Gundogan. Grealish. Gundogan. And back with Grealish. Holland. Oh, big chance. Well, here's the replay, and it shows how patient they were in the build-up. Just so assured, waiting for the right moment, and his movement so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Crush tackling. Gundogan. Good looking ball. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Bernat, not to be advised giving the ball away in that position really bright looking attack Joao Cancelo untidy on the ball now well, they've won possession back, what can they do from here? dangerous looking through ball just wanted to get it out of there They might be able to get in now. Looking for the angle. And Gundogan has beaten the goalkeeper. Well, here it is again, and the defending simply isn't good enough. They have to react quicker, deal with the danger, and show more urgency. None of which they did, and that's the result. Scoreline 4-2. Mbappe. Good use of advantage in favour of PSG. Idrissa Gay. Here is Juan Bernat. 
Paredes. Options in the centre. Marquinhos. Neymar. Body on the line. Might it be Mbappé? Oh, there it is! A lifeline in this game! And what a finale we could be in for here! Well, here's the goal again, and you have to say the patience of the passing is outstanding. They're just waiting for the right time to penetrate, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. Well, how about this? 4-3. De Bruyne onto Silva Gundogan mastery of the passing game well sadly they just couldn't keep possession Mares Rodri and a goal he's put it away a celebratory moment Ask, where's the defending? The keeper is completely exposed, but he still had to finish it and he did it really well. It's a good goal. Scoreline, we see all that often. 5 3. And Messi in full control of the ball here. Well, lovely work to get past his man. Well, defending always has to be a team effort. Good piece of covering. Kyle Walker under pressure here. Full time then, and Paris Saint-Germain have work to do already. Where did it all go wrong for PSG? It's a poor start to their Champions League season. Yeah, they'll be disappointed. It's an uphill battle if you don't get anything from your opening game. It really comes down to how they bounce back now. Vital we see a better performance next time out. Well, it truly was a terrific performance by Erling Haaland, really lighting up this game. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.